Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper and this is my two-minute entertainment rundown for the week of August 23rd. I know you'll be thrilled to hear there's a sequel to the movie Hitman. You might not even know that there was the original. But this one's called Hitman Agent 47. It's an action-packed adventure based on the video game. It stars Rupert Friend and Hannah Ware. And it is packed from action, with action from beginning to end. If that's all you want, then it does deliver. The film is rated R because there is profanity, there is excessive violence. I scored it 5 out of 10. The next movie is playing in limited areas. You might have to seek it out. It's called After Words. And it's a showcase for the talent of Marcia Gay Harden. She plays a plain Jane, her name is Jane in the movie, librarian who decides her life is not even worth living, so she goes off to Costa Rica on a splurging vacation and decides while she's there, she's gonna end it all. Oscar Genada is her co-star. He's good, she's good, the movie is good. It's not rated, but it'd probably be around a PG-13 because of profanity and brief nudity. I scored it six out of 10. Then you wanna go to the bizarre world of America Ultra. This film stars Jesse Eisenberg, Kristen Stewart, and Connie Britton. And it's all about a stoner who finds out he's got these unknown talents because he once was a CIA operative. He's had his mind wiped clear so he doesn't know why he has all these skills that come out when he's in you know, forced situations. That film is rated R for profanity and violence. I scored it. 5 out of 10. Next week we will be talking about three new movies. We've got No Escape with Owen Wilson, We Are Your Friend with Zac Efron, and the Kendricks Brothers film War Room. This has been Jackie K. Cooper with my two-minute entertainment rundown.